Well, neither of those could be described as the best of a bad bunch. Uh, I've never subscribed to the lesser of two evils theorem because that way evil always wins and the, uh, the center of gravity of the evil tilts ever further to more and more evilness. So I never agreed with that idea. But if that were not so, it is simply impossible to argue that Joe Biden is the lesser of two evils in the United States of America. It's not possible to be even more evil than he is. He's the greater of two evils. Uh, there are other candidates that you should vote for in the United States. If I were there, I'd be voting for my good friend, Dr. Jill Stein uh, of the Green Party USA, not to be confused with the Green Party anywhere else, at least not under Jill Stein's leadership. And there are plenty of people that you can vote for in Britain. Uh, my own party, the Workers' Party of Britain, will be fielding candidates in up to 50 constituencies. And we're looking for candidates now, if you're interested, Natalie. Anyone who's interested in being a candidate for the Workers' Party in the parliamentary election later this year should contact me, us, urgently. And uh, we'll see after interview whether you're the right person uh, to stand in one of those up to 50 constituencies. But there are also independents standing everywhere. I met one today uh, who's standing in Thameside uh, against Angela Runner, as they now call her, because she does a runner every time she actually has to be confronted or seen even by one of her constituents, running away from her genocidal record over this last period. 